what's going on guys this is gz welcome to my channel if you guys find this video useful make sure to give this video a like and now let's get into the topic of this video so i have been getting comments regarding this specific chess piece for black knight that this is one of the best that there is and i'm the kind of person who actually always testing either i upload a video or behind the scenes i am always testing and trust me i always appreciate you guys bringing stuff to me and if i could test them i always do uh it is only the set items that i mostly don't i'm not able to test due to the lack of this because right now i am working on inferno 2 this so i cannot test every single one of them but anyways I tested this one here for the bats, I tested the influencer and I also tested the layered aim. Let me show you guys the result then we will talk. Those who seek destruction shall find it. He's been weakened. We must use the source. Those who seek destruction shall find it. <laughs> all right so there goes the result for all three the time to kill and the bad chest is actually slightly faster by millisecond also it really doesn't matter if you have any ascent equipped for shroud of night or not because this guy is always going to pop out whether you have the ascent for it or not and Swarm of Bats chest is going to compensate for the damage which also gave you more damage while you are moving around so that is exactly what we are going to test now doing speed one carbons of echo with all three chests and let's see how this one goes all right on the top right we have the bats just on the bottom left we have the influencer every two primary attack our shadow is going to come and attack and on the right side we have lead aim which is going to mark enemies and on every fifth attack it is going to deal extra damage to that mark enemies so i tried to play on all three just the same way as possible and what I felt is that the bat actually is really good taking down those enemies that are crowding you where the other two actually slightly suffer in that department but when it comes down to the single target well all three are pretty much the same so I would say influencer really isn't that great at all because it isn't offering you anything good that you would say or think otherwise to keep it so it all comes down to the laid aim and the bad chest so let's say if you are playing in party then i would say giving the mark to your party member might increase the damage output of your party total overall for the single target when it comes down to bosses but if you like to move around a lot and wants to take down crowd or monster by yourself then i think back chest is the best way to go and here pretty much all three are doing the same but what my opinion would be that if you are doing open world farming or if you're going to challenge rift or elder rift activity like this the bat 
chest is clearly going to be the winner because it is going to allow you to move more freely while going to deal damage far more than what you can do without that chest and for the lead aim and in the influencer you actually have to stop and do the damage with your primary so if you stack up more damage with the awaken uh ability the awaken thing that you can do then your bats can go even crazier in my opinion you can get the bats damage on your chest shoulder and and chest i think these three are going to give you 30 percent increased bats damage and that is crazy in my opinion if you awaken all those slots with your rank 10 gems so yeah definitely this is the winner all right guys there goes the result and it took me some time to make it up but anyways there goes the result and do let me know what do you guys think about it and yeah i'll see you guys in my next one until then take care have fun and bye guys